Hello everyone. I went uh, online and uh, I bought some of this uh, Delphi uh, device. And uh, you can find it on eBay or Amazon. It's something like uh, 42 pounds. A cheap device. But uh, the problem with it is when you try to install the software and uh, you try to install it on Windows 10 because, you know, Windows 10 is just worse than other <laughs> previous <laughs> and whatever. So I will teach you how to install uh, Delphi 2016 on the 2010 Windows. So first you have to copy the entire disk to your laptop. I made a folder called Delphi and uh, the files should look like this. Something like this. And the first thing uh, you have to do is uh, disable the internet. In Windows 10 you just press this button here and now it's disabled. And you have to disable the antivirus, if you have an antivirus, I don't usually use because it's, I think it's better working without antivirus. And you go to Windows Security, Virus and Threat Protection, Virus and blah blah blah, and you have basically have to disable all of this. Over here. Off, off, off. And that's just about it. Okay. <clears throat> After you did that, you go into the first uh, for the cars, the first folder, and look for uh, this main and make a you just basically send it to the desktop. You make a shortcut, right? Like this. And also to the trucks folder, you do the same. Well, let's call this cars. Okay. And this one we call trucks okay <clears throat> after you've done this you just have to unpack the keygen I will put it on desktop to find it And this is it with this one. Okay, so you double click the cars, for example. And it will call you to software activation. So you do next, blah, 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 next, next, and push the button start. And after this, you perform this uh, activation XML. So you click yes. And I put it to come on desktop and change his name to cars again. Okay. Save. Nah. Okay. And this is the one. You do the same thing for the trucks. Now I will show you how to do it for the cars and 
basically is the same for the trucks. So now you click abort and then uh, you go to Keygen, open this Autocom 2016, blah, blah, blah. Close this page and push this button, activate file, okay? And you look for the file that you have on desktop, this one, okay? So you go to desktop and find the cars XML you created. Open, close this again, and here you can see it's activated. Now it's activated. You close this, you close this one, and you open again the cars because now it's activated and do the same procedure again next 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 start but this time you don't push the yes button you push the no because you already cr created the file you push no <clears throat> and you pick the file that you converted that you uh, key generated and open and now it starts to install It's basically the same to the Windows 7, but uh, here you can see the way to disable the antivirus and internet and shit is different. But basically it's the same on Windows 7 and other. And this is it.